What's going on, everybody? Z here, and welcome back, kind of, to Osiris Nunat. So we haven't looked at it for a while, um, because there hasn't really been a huge update things kind of going on. We started a series, but we kind of left it off, and uh, they came out with these experiences. Now, they've been coming out slowly over time, and I figured it's time to look at them. So we're going to start with one. We're going to start with the space station. Explore its interior and exterior. So if you guys like this episode, you want to see more, definitely like, definitely subscribe if you haven't already. So let's... Okay. All right, um, there we go. This experience enables you to ex oh, explore and spacewalk through the entity of the space station. Keep in mind that it is a preview of its current state and not an indicative of the final in-game experience. Please know under any circumstances there's no collision on much of the space station. This is so you can look at it from outside and inside easily. Okay, so, uh, ooh, this looks nice. This is actually super nice. Why is the lens so dirty? All right, there we go. Uh, we, we cleaned up the lens a little bit. So this is the space station. This is what was it. It used to be outside um, Well, it, it used to be outside. It used to be in space and uh, I remember when you would fly around you'd be able to see it now I it, again, it's been a while since I actually um, It's been a while since we actually played it. So I, I don't know if that's still a thing I think we might actually get back into the series if you guys be interested in that leave a comment down below So oh that looks mildly disturbing um, I understand it's a spacesuit, but at the same time, this is all we've seen of the character so far. <laughs> He's ripped in half. <laughs> oh, okay, so very neat. Oh, geez, it's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Interesting, interesting. Okay, so we got some coupling action here. We got a laptop just floating here. I don't think you can interact with a lot of this stuff. Okay, no. Um, also, these are in no way like a save or anything like that. You can just download them if you have Osiris tuned on. Right underneath of it, there's a, uh, a little a little blip that says uh, Osiris Experiences. So if you want to check it out for yourself, look around, you know, do some things as well. Okay, so let's see. Space is up. Shift is down. Perfect. Okay. <gasps> Ooh. It is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Okay, let's go check out this way. All right, looks like we got, um, I'm guessing, I don't know, would these be storage modules or some kind of computer modules? Oh, wow, it's... Oh, it's way bigger. Oh, we got a lot to explore here. I'm excited. Okay, what's over here? Let's see. We're gonna pick up. The spe we're gonna pick up the pace a little bit. I didn't know how big it was. Oh, it's massive. Ooh, I am so excited for this stuff to happen. Oh, it's it's gonna be a good time. It's gonna be a good time. Um, they did just release a uh, a little update ish blip uh, not too long ago. And they're kind of saying like what's been going on. There hasn't been any updates for a couple months and like what's yeah Like, you know, what's going what's up with what's up with that? You know, wait, did I come? I came this way. Okay, so let's go through here. Let's see what else um, And it's because they've been like reworking a lot of the coding and things like that getting you know more people on board uh, To to make just to make the game better. Okay, so I'm guessing these are gonna be your airlocks probably to enter and exit this looks like you would interact with this and it would probably shut a door here to open a door here. Oh, very neat. Very neat. Okay, so there's no like artificial gravity in here, which is, you know, like semi-realistic because there's there's no artificial gravity. Now, if there's a ring spinning on the outside, I could see where that might float into some uh, artificial gravity. Okay, so it looks like we're going to have multiple airlocks. Um that okay <laughs> there's no collision so multiple airlocks wait why are those on the ground oh that one probably connects there this one probably connects there that one connects there and that one connects there. oh you see how they had to design that very neat that way there's no like interference um holy moly these are huge okay so what do we got in here just more more computer stuff oh this is cool <gasps> This thing is massive. We're going through the inside right now. We'll look at the outside later. Um, oh, it looks so cool. I think that's the planet of Azeal right there. If I'm not mistaken. Um, I guess, I mean, I don't know. Maybe not. Okay, we got an empty chamber here. Oh, this is weird. Now, it looks like... It looks like if you were to... If they were if they had this implemented in the game in any way, it looks like this would actually have 
some type of artificial gravity in it because again this is the outer ring and i don't think it's actually moving right now it's actually moving it's not actually moving right now okay so this is neat it definitely looks like you would be uh you definitely walk around okay there's no collision <laughs> so and then we got a door here should we see what's through here let's go <laughs> let's clip through this door and see what's on this side uh maybe there's nothing out here is there anything out here anything uh no <laughs> there's nothing out here okay so they have it in different segments all right well let's just keep going we'll just go through this way and hop through the other side shoink oh there's like a dining area very neat our music completely stopped it's kind of creepy but you know in the in the solitude of space there's not a whole lot of sounds <laughs> uh okay so we got some containers and whatnot oh my gosh this looks nice this looks this looks good okay i mean the cups you know, whatever i don't i don't care about those little kind of things but oh it looks it looks super cool wait did we miss a uh oh yeah the weigh-ins right there okay so let's go see what's over here. Uh, we got a little kitchen, a little kitchenette area. Very neat. Uh, sink, yeah, okay, so this definitely would be meant to have some type, some type of artificial gravity. Especially because, I mean, you have seats there, it'd be kind of hard to sit there. And you have a sink that has a drain, so that means it'd have to have some way of, uh, you know, doing it, doing its thing, doing its thing, gravitating towards the drainal area. <laughs> so, all right, let's head up here. Oh, this looks cool. This is very neat. Okay, so are we on the bottom most one? We are on the bottom most one. Okay, so we gotta go. We gotta pop in over there. I guess we should just keep going. I want us to check out what those are. Those look neat. I don't know what those are gonna be though. Maybe some sort of like vegetation? Some sort of uh some growing kind of mechanism, maybe? Maybe something like that? Indoor gardens? Maybe? I don't know. This is super cool though. This is super cool. I really can't wait for this to become like part of the game. I don't there. I don't think there's any timelines or anything like that of uh, of when this is actually going to happen. Oh, yeah. See, there's a ladder. OK, I was kind of wondering. I was like, how would you transition from gravity to no gravity? And it looks like this ladder might be your option to do so. Let's go down here. So this looks like a, a laboratory section, a laboratory wing kind of thing. Uh, what do we got in these containers? Looks like rocks. Okay, so we're studying stuff. Very neat. Now, I really honestly wouldn't be surprised to see some kind of alien life in here because, I mean, we encounter aliens on the daily down on the surface of the planet. So it really wouldn't be surprising to see something like that. Uh, very, very neat. I'm like, this is, I can't wait for this stuff to be implemented. Oh my gosh, this is going to be super cool. All right, so let's see what else we got. Uh, let's head to the other side. My gosh, we're just like floating straight up. <laughs> it's so, it's so weird. I feel like I should be like moving. Oh yeah, there's definitely like, definitely like little chambers. I don't know what those chambers are called. I know they're called something though. They have a name. They've got to have a name. Um, I'm moving my, <laughs> I'm like moving my head to try to like, oh my gosh, get in, uh, get in line with this. Okay, so let's go see. There's probably a top one. There is a top one. All right, let's check this guy out. <laughs> let's go up. <laughs> okay, so what do we got here? Um, oh, workout area. Okay, so you got some treadmills and what is that? Maybe a shower of some sort. It's probably, probably some sort of shower. Absolutely, that's I'm yep, probably a shower. Okay, and whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> wrong way. Some more treadmills, storage area. What do we got here? What are these? Oh, those are toilets. <laughs> there's there's toilets, <gasps> space toilets. Wow, you have to come all the way over here to take a Take a take a deuce. Ugh. I'd hate for you know eat some bad Chinese one night. You have to make a run for it. <laughs> oh, okay. So let's head back. Oh, there's like little switches everywhere. It's very neat, very neat. And this is funny because this is actually the ceiling. Because if you look at it, it's like, well, why is there panels and stuff on? Because you're not walking on that. You'd be walking down here. Oh, this is super cool. Very cool. Okay, so let's head back towards the green section. Let's see what's up there. Oh my gosh, it's gonna take us an hour just to get down. Let's go. All right, so we got some sleeping chambers in here. Now I don't know if these would be gravity affected or not. I don't think so because we're in the centermost centermost part. So I imagine this would probably be rotating in a in a this early type fashion or this early type fashion. I don't know because it depends on which way you're looking at it. You know. All right, so what do we got here? Uh, these definitely look like power cores of some sort. 
If I was a betting person, I would bet these are power cores. Definitely looks like it. Uh, electrical hazard authorized personnel. It's a it's a canister. Maybe it's some type of a uh, capacitor or something. This is definitely the power area for sure. I like how there's just like laptops floating around and stuff. It's kind of, it's kind of funny. It's like, hey, I came in here. I was working on here. I just I just left it there. You know, it's it's fine. It's not going to go anywhere. You don't have to worry about your cables breaking because guess what? That's not that's not going to go anywhere. Oh my gosh, there's more. Ooh. Okay, so these are the greenery pods area. Oh, these are super cool. <gasps> oh. Oh, they even have like a water. F oh, this is cool. They're all like moving and everything. Like there's a, oh, there's, there is. There's like a, a, a circulation system in here. Oh, this is very neat. So actually curious because we saw the spacesuits chill in there, right? So these are probably producing some sort of oxygen system. Uh, maybe some kind of carbon scrubbing system. Very neat. Uh, we, why do we have our spacesuit on? <laughs> like, you know, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Why do we have ours on? This is cool. Okay, so now this section right here. Why are these plants special and these ones aren't? Maybe these are some type of, uh, I don't know. Some sort of vegetation? I don't know. No, because those look like bananas. Those look like bananas. If you ask me, I'm saying they're bananas. Oh my gosh, look at how cool this is. I like how they have the water flowing. Those definitely look like bananas. 100%. Okay. Uh, you know what? Is there actually a way to rotate? I don't think there is. There's no way to rotate. You can strafe and you can go up and down. Very neat. Okay, let's go check out this, uh, wait, so do we see four of these? I think we saw four of them. So let's go check out, is there another one up here? Let's go check out up here. I want to see if there's anything different amongst the four of them. Because maybe each one serves a purpose. This one looks bigger. No, it's not. It's not bigger. Okay. <laughs> but we, we are upside down in this one. Okay, so this looks pretty much the same. Yep, okay. Um, I'm getting lost now. Oh my gosh. Sense of direction, man. It's it it's getting rough in here. Alright, so there's that one. Oh, we had a little little power. Oh, somebody somebody lost their laptop, guys. That's what happened. There's another one lost. Somebody you know, that's why you just can't leave things out like that. Okay. Uh I I don't even know. I think we went that way and then we went up. Okay. And then let's just, we'll just peek over here real quick. I know it's going to be exactly set. I keep dodging this and I know we're not going to clip, but it's definitely cool to see. Everything in here is about the same. Yeah. Okay. Very neat. Very neat. I cannot wait to see this implemented. Uh, and it runs good. It's running, running quite nice. I must say we're running a solid like 80 frames. So actually we're going up to like a hundred now. But uh, those uh, those moving plants did bring it down just a hair, just a hair. Okay, so what do we got in here? Looks like we got another sleeping area. Oh, does this? Oh, it's just an opened. Okay, okay. Wait, I want to see what. Hold on, I want to go in there. Is there something up? Is hold on, hold on. Let's go, let's go. We gotta check it out. Uh, oh, what's in here? What's it? What's in here? <laughs> oh, whoa, hold on. This is a collision area. Okay, so they don't want you to see right there. All right, that's fine. We'll just go this way. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's check this out. We're going to look at it from the outside now. All right, so what is this? Okay, so this is the thruster engine system area. Looking nice. Got some big old thrusters on here. Wonder what's inside of them. Nothing. Very, very cool. Oh my gosh, this thing is super neat. So this is definitely not the same one that we saw floating around. Uh, this one definitely has a lot more texturing, a lot more modeling on it. And oh, I like it. It's kind of cool that you can't see inside of these because of the, uh, the plant ones. Very cool. Oh, we got some solar panels up here. 
So they're shielding. It looks like it's shielding. Prob yeah, it's probably some type of, uh, you know, like UV or radiation shielding. Oh, look at the shine on this guy. Can I see my reflection? No. Okay. RTX not on. But that's super cool. Very neat. Very neat. Okay. I like that. Wow. Man. Looks nice. Okay. So. Oh. That was us. We were in those tubes. That's so funny. That is so funny. It'd be so fun to play this multiplayer for sure. Because you could just see like your friends like floating around in here doing their thing. It's like, hey. What are you guys doing on the treadmills? Are you pooping? I can see you pooping. <laughs> if there was no privacy. <gasps> oh, that'd be so weird. That'd be like super weird. There's absolutely no privacy. Using the bathroom. Don't worry about me, guys. Don't worry about me. All right, so let's take a look at the front of this guy. So this is definitely, uh, definitely the cockpit up here, or the flight deck, or whatever you want to call it. Let's see what it looks like from the outside, and then we're gonna just like you know magically go right back on the inside. Oh, this is cool. Oh. This almost looks like it's like a, a shielding that would maybe drop over. I would say, but they, I mean, these don't, these aren't going to obviously drop over. Okay, let's just do this. Shoink! Right back in here. Haha, <laughs> wait a second. Oh, I thought there was a collision on the seat. I was like, that's weird. Very, very neat. This is super cool. Very cool. Like, I love how detailed all this stuff is. I mean,. From from what we've what we've been playing so far in the game, everything looks super detailed. North, east, south, west. Okay. I thought that west was an E sideways. I was like, wait, are we just sideways right now? Alrighty. Very neat. Very cool. I like it. It is it is super cool, I must say. I must say. Um, I'm definitely looking forward to this. So uh yeah, that is actually gonna wrap up this this first first look. Where uh, I'm just gonna make an episode over each one, so they're gonna be shorter episodes. That's fine. Um, I just thought it'd be kind of cool to cover all these and show you guys maybe what they're what they're working on here. Let's just pop out of here and see what. Shoink. Oh, super cool. Oh, there's like a, even a grabby arm. Oh, you know what? Is this a docking station? I feel like this is a docking station. And these probably help you line up to this shuttle. Oh, very cool. Very cool. Um, but yeah. Alrighty, guys. That is going to end it. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe as well. I know these are shorter little episodes. Uh, but I just figure, you know, this would be kind of fun to cover. Find it kind of fun to look at. I think there's, what, 3, 6, 9, 12, 13, 14. I think there's like 14 total. So... We're just gonna make a little individual episode on each one. Again, I, you know, I haven't even looked at any of them, so I have no idea. My first reaction. Um, but yeah, very cool, very neat. Can't wait to see some of this implemented in the game. Again, there's no dates on anything, but um, but yeah, and if you guys are interested, I'll have a link down below to the Steam store page for this game. And if you guys want to see some more of the series, let me know for sure. But uh, yeah, you guys have a wonderful, wonderful week. <laughs>